Hello, this is David for Studio One Expert. I'd like to show you how you can export raw unprocessed audio tracks from Studio One. Now, this could be helpful when, for example, you want to send your song to a mixing engineer to mix it, then he would most likely prefer that you send him unprocessed audio tracks. Now we could use the export stems function for that and select tracks, but since all stems include inserted plugins, um, fader positions, panorama positions, we need to make sure first to turn off all plugins, set all faders to zero, set all panorama in the middle, etc. etc. So there is a much easier way to do this in Studio One. If you'd like to know more about the export stamps function, you can watch my last video where I explained pretty much everything there is to know about it. But now let's have a look at how we can export uh, unprocessed audio tracks much quicker in Studio One. Okay, there are two things to note first. If you'd like to include instrument tracks in your export, you need to transform them first to audio tracks. I have one drum track here with Easy Drummer. Just right click and select transform to audio track. This is done. And the second thing, if you have some tracks sitting in folders, then you need to open the folders first. Okay, I go ahead and hit Alt and Z, or Option Z on a Mac, to get an overview of my song. And then select the Range tool, or just hold on Control or Command on a Mac, and draw a selection range from the very end of the tracks to the very beginning, across all tracks like this. The next step is only optional, but you can remove unnecessary lengths from the tracks to give you a smaller file size. To do that, hold down Ctrl and Alt or Command and Option on a Mac. And just with this, you can take out selection ranges from the entire selection, like this. And if there are tracks you don't want to include in the export, for example, let's say these two tracks here, then of course you can take them out of the selection completely. You don't need to worry about automation tracks because they will not get exported anyway. As the next step, let's open the browser and create a folder for our tracks. You can do this anywhere on your computer. I will just make a new folder here and call it Raw Audio. And then all we need to do is grab the selection range somewhere and uh, drag it to our folder and Studio One does the rest. That's it. So let's see what we got. I will open a new song by hitting Ctrl and N. Select all these tracks and drag them into the arrangement. And as you can see, we have no unnecessary lengths. Mono tracks got exported as mono tracks, stereo tracks as stereo tracks, and we only have the tracks which were included in our selection range. Couldn't be any easier. Thanks for watching. I've been David. Bye bye.